Okay, good afternoon. Um, we are here in Davy Crockett National Forest. Um, we're staying near Crockett, Texas. So we wanted to come out here and do some hiking. Um, we chose for our first hike out here, uh, Neche's Bluff Trail. Probably butchering the pronunciation of that somehow. Um, yeah, it's supposed to be like a five mile out and back trail. So far, we're like literally just starting and it's not super well maintained. Lots of um, grass overhang on the trail, but you can also see where it is. So it's followable thus far. Um, yeah, we'll uh, take you guys along for the ride so you can know if uh, you want to come out here and do this hike. Again, out in Davy Crockett National Forest, Neche's Bluff Trail, something like that. Anyway. Glad I put on some good solid DEET. Uh, there's definitely a <laughs> good chance of ticks on this trail with how overgrown it is. Um, very pretty though. There's lots of gorgeous trees. It feels very remote. Hey Justin. Yeah. How's your wrist? Doing much better. Yay! Grip things and start the car. <laughs> that was a big milestone starting the car. Chop vegetables. Sort of. Pretty well. <laughs> Walk being across the bridge. Oh, that doesn't feel stable. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> More of a one person at a time bridge, really. We've been here for a couple weeks now. We'll be in Texas all winter, basically, because um, we're not going to Florida to visit family, sadly. Um, but because of the pandemic and everything, we're still kind of trying to generally keep our distance. And Florida is uh, a pretty risky state as far as it goes. So we're keeping our distance here in Texas. We're gonna be heading south as it gets colder, heading north hopefully when it gets a little warmer. I'm um, eventually making our way out west. Um, yeah, just been enjoying relaxing, hiking, campfires. Jerky break. Dick check. Beep, beep, beep. Good. So this stretch of the trail so far has been very wide um, and it's following along the electrical lines, the power lines that are running through here. I'm hoping it shoots off at some point. It's pretty sure that's where gators live. Oh, something flopped. 
There's something flopping around in there. Is it a gator? Looks like a lizard maybe or a snake. Like a large lizard, like a gator. From now on I rate all trails based on how many armadillos approach me. So far this trail, zero armadillos. I think a lot of people just view armadillos as, as vermin, right? That's rude though. I mean, <laughs> Alright, I'm climbing over. Justin t chose to go around. He might have made the better choice. guys I found a very rare and rarely seen Michelob Ultra tree. It's uh, only found here in the Davy Crockett National Forest. Uh, Michelob Ultriatus I believe is the scientific name. Davy Crockett, King of the Wild Frontier. Davy Crockett, King of the Wild Frontier. Did you just sing that on a loop? Oh yeah. I don't think so. can't breathe underwater, can they? I don't think so. What is that? If it's an armadillo, I still give this zero armadillos. Dead armadillos don't count. We've got maybe half a mile before the trail turns back around. But it's also hard to tell where the trail is. Yeah, it's right here. Trees in the middle of the path. Awkward. <laughs> graceful. So graceful. <laughs> <laughs> 
course you have. Well, we're going to have to go back that way. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's where we came from. Oh, there's more trail that way, though. Huh. We are on the 4C now, though, it says. Right? Yeah. Which which goes on, I know the 4C that goes, goes on, on for, for a miles long and, time. Like 19 miles. Yeah. So, I think this is where we should maybe end it. Okay. Let's do it. All right. We're Turning at, around. Uh, oh, yeah. What mileage are we at? 2.6 uh, from where we started. So we're 2.6 in. The best part was the last half mile. Yeah, that was really cool in the um, forest and stuff. It's joined up with the 4C trail now, which is a 20 mile hike, uh, which we are not going to do <laughs> at this time. No. Um, you saw that sign back there? I don't know what that means, but we're definitely going back that way because that's where we came from. Um, but we weren't supposed to be on the 4C trail. We're supposed to be on the Neches Bluff trail. So maybe they kind of follow they, the same trail. Yeah, they course. actually meet up. Um, and if they didn't want us to go that way, then they should have put a sign on the other on side. The other side. <laughs> but anyway, we're going to turn around now. What kind of bird did you just see? I believe it was a marsh wren. Yeah, I think it was a marsh wren. Definitely had like wren characteristics and we're near a marsh, so um, that would make sense. But I did not get the best look at it that I could have before it disappeared into the brush, the marshy brush. Mm -hmm.